Hey everyone, this is Shane back at it again. Uh, wanted to do a second video on another car for this month's entry. Uh, this car gave me fits. I worked on this thing for about four and a half months or so. Uh, it is an original issue Johan 60, 61. Oldsmobile station wagon. Can't remember the year of it. Uh, took me about a month before I could before I got any primer on this thing. Uh, shaved all the door handles and emblems off. Made the hood. The hood actually there'll be more stories on all this here in a second but like I said it it was a gave me a fit a bunch of stuff did I two-toned it a duper color bottom color is a silver frost upper is duper colors anodized purple and this one was cleared with duplicolor so everything on this was from duplicolor uh, the hood like I said I made the hood scratch build it it actually was painted five different times it broke once uh, and this was like two weeks before the Atlanta show last year. Wheels are from Steven Zimmerman on Facebook. Future attraction brake rotors and calipers. Did all the bare metal full. Uh, strip the front and rear bumpers, chrome. I don't know if it'll show, but I actually painted them body colors. Uh, did the same with the back bumper. Tail lights I paint stripped them same color as the front up there. Under the hood, I just used a kit motor. Uh, I scratch built the firewall. Uh, brake booster is from VCG resins, and the master cylinder was from Kit's parts box. Scratch built the radiator cover. Uh, intake and breather was from the Lindbergh 37 Ford. I modified it to fit. Uh, scratch built my headers. Uh, parts by parts. Distributor wires with detail master wire looms. Completely shaved the inner fenders and everything. You know the match uh, under here wasn't much to do made the exhaust the interior I uh, I flocked VCG steering column, seat belts, uh, detail master window and crank handles, future attraction BM shifter, uh, I made a 
roll up tonneau cover in the back. Use Detail Master uh, speedometer cluster on it. Made a headliner. It's old Joe Hand kit, so everything up above the glass was exposed. Uh, pretty fun build. Just to see something different to than the normal wagons that you know been usually put out. I'm pretty happy with the outcome, but I do have some pictures of the build. I think still of this, so they'll be posted at the end. And like I said, you know, good luck to everyone. Hope everyone does well and everybody participates and judges fairness and all uh, and I guess that's it so we'll holler at y'all later